What's up, guys? So, as promised, this is going to be my segment review for the Garmin Edge 520 using the Strava segments, but we're not using the live segments from Strava. This is the uh, basically the free version of segments that you can get on Strava. So, if you go to Strava's Segment Explorer, and here you can just browse your local segments. Um, we're looking at one right here. You want to select the segment you're going to use. You'll go to the segment page. Um, you'll view this full segment. And then you want to choose the URL by selecting it and copying it. And then you're going to paste it into this uh, website, which is Gniza, G N I Z A dot org. Just search for that on Google. Paste it in, search for it, and it'll load. And what you'll have basically is a segment that you can download. And this file is going to let you save it to your Garmin Edge. Um, you can also choose the assignment assigned times for that segment. Um, for this one, I used the leader, which was probably a bad idea because there's no way I can ride um, this loop in 7 minutes and 57 seconds or anywhere near that. Uh, so I decided to choose one that was a little bit further down the list this time. And we went with uh, around, I think it was about 10 minutes which seemed a little more reasonable, but still probably faster than I could do. So you can really search through any of the leaderboards and choose whichever one you want to use as your selected time. And then you'll export the fit file and you want to copy the fit file that you downloaded from your download folder into your Garmin Edge folder. And it's going to be in the segments folder. So just open up Garmin, go to segments, and then right click and paste it in and you can see I have quite a few other segments here that I've copied in as well and the nice thing is these files are very small so they're not going to take up a lot of space on your edge once you have that segment copied in uh, that's all you have to do and now you can go to writing okay and so now we're testing on the bike um, as you can see it's a normal heads up display and then when you get to the uh, segment, it gives you an alert and tells you that you have a distance countdown and it drops as you get closer to the segment. And it then says go when you reach the actual segment. And you get the go alert just after the countdown finishes. And it worked quite well. I tried it out on several different segments. And then during your ride, you get the overview map the map also pops up at the beginning when you see the segment start time or location. And you can see you have your comparisons, but then you can also go back and just view your normal screen while you're still on the current segment, but it doesn't show you your comparison to the other rider at the same time. And when you complete the segment, it says your finish time. And of course, mine was nowhere near my selected competitor, but it works quite well. Um, I haven't had any problems so far and it's running great. I might be picking up one of the speed or cadence sensors in the near future um, and if I do I will do a review of the connectivity of that and keep everyone in touch. So I hope this helped out if you're trying to use Garmin live segments uh, with the Garmin Edge 520. Thanks for watching.